first of all, I think uh, the game was exciting. I think you are seeing two teams that want to play football. Today they changed a little bit the plan. They surprised us when we saw the lineup with four central defenders and they changed the system. Uh, it's normal when you have seven, eight days to prepare a game, you can do these things. When you don't have time, it's difficult to, to prepare different things. But even with that, I think we get adapted very good. I think we dominated uh, the beginning of the match. Then we considered a goal in a mistake because of a lack of attention, and I think these mistakes are killing us during the whole season. After we got the equalize in an act of personality of the team, we could even score the second goal. And then uh, we started with energy the second half, but we started then losing to uh, starting to lose that energy. Uh, they created a very clear chance to be ahead on the score. From there, we tried to dominate again. We had the uh, chance of of Peter Banda. Uh, in the end, I was talking to your colleagues on the TV. I don't know if the result is fair, is not fair. But I think uh, at least we tried our best. And uh, from there, we need to to see what's going on and this is what we have this year and we are changing and we have only three offensive players on the bench and when you are changing you are expecting to be for the for the best and it didn't work so also we have to think about that Sorry. coach uh, due to this result are you considering yourself out of the race are you going to asking me the same question because since I'm here in the fifth or sixth match day you are asking me the same and I can continue answering you the same. The mathematics says that there are still 18 points, that there are 10 points of difference between the two teams and that we are going to try to fight for every single point as we did today. This is what Simba is going to do, what our fans deserve what our batch and our club deserve, and this is what we are doing, working hard, like today we tried to win this game, even if it was a difficult circumstances, um, but I'm answering to you the same. Uh, if I say now that it's done, I could have said the same from the fifth match day when I arrived here, because everybody knew what was going to happen this, this season, and you can continue seeing uh, the things that we cannot control, how they go for all of our opponents and how they go for, for us. So, Do you think to miss uh, some players is because to take uh, this result today? Sorry? Do you think to miss some players is it cause uh, to take this result today? No, no, no. We uh, play with the players we have and I'm not going to say that uh, the lack of players, the injuries, uh, are excuses for us to not to win this game. Uh, not to win this game is something that maybe uh, it's normal according to their level and according to our level. I think the last five years when Simba became champion and probably had a better squad, better team, better players, if you check the results against Simba and Assam, uh, are not very good. I think this year, since I'm here, we beat them twice and we are getting a draw away. So I think we are over average compared with champion teams before. And I cannot say that the team didn't perform today. We perform, but sometimes the post, sometimes the lack of quality when we are having a clear chance in front of the goalkeeper or the lack of capacity to manage this environment for some players is decisive. And this is what's happening the whole season. That maybe we are creating clear chances often and we are not converting these chances and also we are making uh, silly mistakes like the one uh, we conceded in the goal they are scoring and when that happens and you are playing against another team that it's also very good the result maybe can be like that but no excuses about the lack of players this is what we have with this we compete and we try to do our best thank you coach Unajiuliza namna gani utapata taarifa za michezo zenye uhakika kwa timu zipendazo ni rahisi sana Mpenja TV ipo kwa ajili ya kukupa matukio yote makubwa kutoka kwenye maeneo mbali mbali mashabiki wachezaji viongozi wa michezo hapa ndio kwao sasa tembelea channel yetu ya YouTube kupitia simu yako au laptop andika Mpenja TV 
ukutana na taarifa kibao za uhakika kisha bofia ya subscribe uwe mwana familia na bofia ya alama ya kengele upate taarifa kila inapoingia na pia fuatilia updates za taarifa zetu kupitia Instagram kwa kuandika mpeja tv underscore mpeja tv tunazungumza michezo oh!